All right. Just want a quick tip when it comes to the giant E rain. I will say it applies also to the trance. The biggest creaking and issues that I've had with all these, because my wife and daughter have them also. Paint this nut right here, the bottom bolt going into the shock. You can, so when you can do a quick visual and see that it has loosened up. This will start creaking really bad. Same for this low pivot on the other side. Put this little marker on it so you can see and check these torques before, after each ride, just to make sure. I don't know about the E-Rain yet, but the motor mounting bolts, there's four. There's, I ended up cutting this out so I can do easy checks without pulling off all the plastic. There's also another one in here. It's hard to get off. You have to pull the ring. There's two on the other side. The two on the other side are pretty long and I haven't really had any issues. The two on this drive side are, uh, I don't know, half inch long. And they don't go in there really deep. So this one was loose and this one was loose. I've since Loctited them and haven't had any issues. This is where I was getting the most creaking on this one. That's where I learned it. So mark these bolts stop the creaking.